Hey buddy, what's going on? Welcome to Learn Hunter. In this episode, we are talking about the migrations and also ENV. So firstly, we run our server. Write PHP artisan serve command. When we write PHP artisan serve, our project will be started so our project are also running localhost clone 8000 port press enter and our project are running so just i just opened our project on sublime text you can see that dot env file exists here i just write our database name like apple our username root and password is blank so we did not have any other data any database which is apple so just going to localhost slash psp admin and create a database which whose name is apple now create exactly right our project and database are connected so now i want to create a table so we are also create table here but we don't use it we just use laravel migration command just copy it or you can write also open another cmd here or git bash or shell paste here this is php artisan make migration this command means we want to create a migration file which is table name like uh, students all tables are must be plural it's a good practice a students so press enter and our migrant file was created but our migration file created but we don't have any table it's blank apple is totally blank so you can see that database migrations and students migration file are here this is our tables field name first is id which is auto increments we can also make other fields how much we want okay so i just remove it i want that student name student name student email student phone okay and all are string a string means bar character if you want to write integer right here integer okay so i just write a string okay now our schema was created now i just want to create a table like students so just right here not here and all must be save control plus a save now write php artisan migrate so when you run php artisan migrate our migration file are generate exactly right oops level 5.7 5.6 5.4 shows uh, a problem when we run our migrate command cause our app app service provider providers app service provider we use schema length so i just copy from my other project 
just app providers app service providers this line are include here which is schema default string length 191 and also use schema on the top just copy here okay now save which is 1 and 2 you can see that just reload your database two tables are already exist i just did here did also from here now run this command again php artisan migrate press enter and yes all table are created okay so strings table are created structure and student name student email student phone created update created and updated at default which comes are here timestamps okay and it's auto increment primary id you can also use nullable which is null okay and you can also use unique which is must be unique not duplicated so our migration file are created and must be used to line on app service provider and our database name are existing here apple so this is our env file and we don't need include any other file cause we write our database name just env file and our migration file are also created so don't worry just stay with learn hunter and if you are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe like comment and share thanks for watching